Look, Cam, the last building stone. The last one, mate. The last one. And she's in. Beautiful. Well, hey. Boom. Sign, seal, delivered. Ah, oh, finally, a morning of beautiful blue. Anyway, it is lovely and early, Saturday morning. Uh, we've just started with doing the ends, getting them up. Unky Dory obviously uncovered the wall. She's looking good. It's been hard with that, uh, having that canopy over the last few days because you can't really see her, but no, happy with that. So yeah, we're just gonna get on the back now, get a load of heart in there, get it all sealed, etc. Um, and then we're gonna start the tops. So what I've done here, you don't think you can see it actually, is I've set up a line doo -doo -doo, from this point. So he's just gonna go on that, oh God, right in the face, on that stone there. And that's just gonna run all the way to the other one. Um, just because I want, you know, the tops to really meet up perfectly, just so it looks like one continuous wall. Here's a bit higher this end. Um, so what I might do is maybe lower that because obviously we've we followed the top of the wall with the bank but obviously same again it's followed the top course of that wall to that wall basically so you can just see that's the top there just going to the top you know the mortar line basically but I so say yeah dry stone effect so obviously we just put them on a slight bed of mortar and then just sort of butt them up and then rake back any mortar that's showing but no that's it for today we're just going to really crack it out try and get it done on a couple of hours like and then uh yeah, let it go off a little bit, then we'll flaunch to the back, make smooth it all up, and uh, yeah, job will be a good one. So anyway, without further ado, Cam Cam, what are we doing? Crack, Crack on. Got the back done, got it um, basically flat because um, it is quite a wide wall and uh, the tops we've got, um, Zach Sam and this wall, were obviously to the front of the wall. So there's gonna be a bit of a back. So we'll evaluate uh, what we're gonna do with the back. What I'll probably do is just get the mortar flat and obviously flaunch it down underneath um, the membrane up there. And that'll just help with any surface water because that membrane, it, it sort of looks more like a sort of DPC sort of thing. It's uh, Yesterday when it was raining, all the water was just coming off it. It's, it's not like, you know, permeable, you know what I mean? So anyway, we're, um, we're trying to lip that over it, just so it's like a bit of a gutter, basically, because it's going downhill. You should then push it down, basically. But um, so that'll just help as well. Um, but uh, yeah, so we are just cracking on. Cam's knocking up some mortar. I'm going to start getting a load of tops over. As you can see, we haven't got a massive... Um, Massive choice of stone, but I've uh, started anyway. So what I'm trying to aim for is ones like this, should we say, just so they've got a slight point on them. And then obviously when we butt them up, it will be sort of similar to like that all the way along, basically, just so they've got like a nice edge. You know what I mean? Quite the triangular is probably the best word. So yeah, so I'm just going to go for a big hunt, try and. Um, yeah, fetch out as many as I can. The wall's all settling well now. You know, so, you know, once it dries out, it, it does look a lot better. Weather is looking a bit, a bit shady wady, but we've got some hope over there. It's getting bright in places. So it's forecast not to rain today, just be cloudy. So we want that basically, especially these tops, because, uh, yeah, we want them to, you know, go off. Well, anyway, let's, uh, crack on and uh, let's get these tops on and see how she's gonna look because I think it's gonna really finish it off I'm really excited and uh, yeah job will be a good one righty let's uh, crack on
Oh, oh, oh. Getting a bit low on stone now. Having to uh, play around with uh, these big ones over. That's all we've basically got. So we're about two thirds. I personally think she's looking absolutely lovely. We'll look at her straight on. So yeah, no, it's really looking good. It's just trying to get them as tight as possible. Um, you know, but it uses so much stone. So I think when she's done, she's going to look lovely. Like I say, I've got to line up just obviously using that as a rough, rough sort of guide, if you know what I mean. No, yeah, happy with that. I think, yeah, it's looking really, really looking forward to getting this done now. So, yeah. It's all going up all right. All going up all right. So, if it's all here, what we do, we let it go off a little bit and then we'll uh, sort of push back the mortar. Yeah, no, just trying to keep them, like I say, really tight. Trying to keep that edge flowing back as well. It just makes it look a lot nicer. But yeah, like I say, it's just, uh, you know, it's not perfect to the line, but I don't, I don't, I don't like the look, you know, I don't want it looking perfect. I want it, I want it looking rustic and old. But yeah, after a bit of weather on her, she's gonna look good, but that's the thing. We're using a lot of the new stone and stuff we got from the quarry over there. Um, we're using a lot for the tops, but the only thing now that look at it it's just so small even all this stuff is really small so we've uh, played around with it but you know most of it is just you know harm your hand size so it's all right we're not moaning we're just uh contemplating but uh yeah so let's go finish with coffee and then get that last well i suppose it is the last third just under yeah just just under two thirds of the way still got that so yeah get that done and uh she's gonna look good love it Righty, uh, let's crack on and uh, get this baby done. go she's up she's done she's got a hat on she should be good now thankfully the uh, weather's held out for us which is always a bonus but yeah and no, i think she's looking lovely so it is saturday so what we've done i've just basically used my finger for the top and just sort of brushed it back and then it's only one daylight so by um sunday well monday sorry um, I sh should be able to go around with a wire brush and just obviously brush it all off the stone. But it's not too bad, as you can see. I think it looks nice, actually. It's nice to see a line as well from the uh, tops to the wall. That's why it's vital we're always getting the top level, you know what I mean? Well, straight, should I say. But no, I think she fits in really well. The line's done its job as well because it sort of flows on from that wall. It does go a bit low on that old wall, but there's nothing we could do about that. But it flows into it off so yeah give it a couple of years or something and uh she'll weather in but no lovely jubbly so yeah monday we are coming back well i am cam cam's not cam cam's starting another job i'll be back with digger man and we're gonna go through the stone um from the stuff we've got delivered there just pick out any big bits there's a few big ones left but uh yeah, most of it is just rubble and mud and uh yeah just obviously pick, like i say pick up the stone separate it all and then yeah a big old clear up basically uh brush over that there's a bit of stuff to do at the back as well which i'll crack on first thing um just because i want to flaunch it up to that uh membrane what i was talking about earlier but no overall i'm happy with that lovely job i think she suits well look look at that eh you know it doesn't actually look that bad now that wall once that calms down and dries once it all you know like the bottom half i think it'll you know it'll blend in lovely but yeah 
look of that, eh? I think it's lovely. Lovely look onto the church now. It's, uh, yeah, beautiful. It's just, uh, like I say, shame, shame the whole wall's not like it, but we did what we came here to do, and that's what we've done. So anyway, I'm going to crack on with my weekend, have a nice chill out, and, uh, yeah, see what happens Monday. Seal this job off, and uh, on to the next. Righty. Over and out, and uh, see ya in a bit.